Hey guys, this is Devin with Gateway Builders. Today we are starting on a smaller build that we got a phone call from a guy yesterday. He told us, hey, can you guys start on this build pretty quick? You know, it's a smaller job, it's here in town. What can you guys do? So we have a small little gap between two jobs. We are going to get it started for him. Yesterday I went and got material for the job. The job measures 27 wide by 40 long. It's going to be a clear spam I beam construction here in North Texas. The job right here is in Decatur and that's our hometown. So we're able to get to it extremely quick. We got material this morning and we're starting construction today. This job is going to last two days. We're going to allow you to see the different steps that we take to ensure this job turns out well for the customer. Let's go ahead and get started. This is a perfect example of construction right here. So we get these posts set and then we're trying to go right below this E right here with this post. And on this particular build, the back of the house is only allowing like seven inches. And then on the front of this house, it's allowing 12 inches because the back of the mobile home is settled. So now we got to take these posts down and we got to cut them down a couple more inches and that's going to make us have to cut all these sheets all the way around shorter because now the sidewall is shorter so one more hurdle that we got to overcome
inside the all new 2020 Kubota 75 by two uh, over here from Zimmer Kubota in Decatur, Texas. Their Kubota's doing something right because it is frigid in this machine. Amazing in here. I mean, it, it's got all the amenities. It's got the stereo, enclosed cab, you only got to use your hands. I talked to an old guy one time in Justin. He has been doing skid steer work, you know, for years and years. He had a Kubota 75 enclosed cab, and he told me, he said, Devin, get an enclosed cab. At the time, I was running a open cab, uh, hands and feet, uh, Bobcat T590. And he said, Devin, go out and get an enclosed cab. And I was like, man, I, I am not spending that much money on a machine like that. Man, was he right. He says, you're going to work in the heat of the day when no one wants to work because you're comfortable. You're going to work when it's so cold outside, all the other contractors are staying at home and, and, and sleeping because you're comfortable. That tip right there has made me so much more money because I'm comfortable, you know. How many times have you pulled up to a job? You guys who run equipment know what I'm talking about. You pull up to a job and you start moving dirt and it's getting in your eyes, it's getting in your mouth, you, you know, you're tasting it, you're wearing it. You, you want to get done with the job quick because you don't want to be out there. You're in an enclosed cab now, it's a, it's a game changer. You are now able to do all that same work, but you're scooping dirt, you're not getting it on you, you're, you're allowed to be on the job, do it the way you want to do it, be a lot cleaner at it because now you're, you're paying more attention to it and you're, you're, you're doing the best you can because you're comfortable. You're getting a lot better product, your customers are knowing because you're getting more phone calls and you're working more, you're making more money. So guess what, now the machine pays for itself. So. That's my quick bit on the uh, enclosed cab on Kubota. And if you guys are afraid to pull that trigger because of the price tag, I understand. I was in that same boat and I mean, it's one of those deals, once you do it, you don't go back and you know, you, you just pay the bill and you make the money. So that's it, man. That's all I got for you, thanks. We're cutting the video short. We got some weather coming in. Uh, a lot of wind just came in, 20 mile an hour gusts, and all these clouds came in. So we got a lot done today. We got the post set, we got the trusses up, and all the roof purlins are on. So we're gonna give it a shot tomorrow morning and see how far we make it tomorrow. Uh, but it's Friday today, and I promised all the guys we'd go to lunch, and they worked through the lunch, so we're all gonna go out to a restaurant holler at you later peace hey guys this is Devin this is the morning of day two I had to move some equipment around today and got a little bit of a late start had to drop the trailer but I'm on my way right now to the job site the guys got here about 7 30 so let's get to it
What's up YouTube? This is day three on this project. The customer called and they did a change order, wanted to install a 20 foot patio on the front of this to park under. So I made a material run this morning and we got everything here for them. So let's get started on day three. This job's gonna take a little bit longer than what we anticipated on, but that's okay, you know. Let's get it. Thank you. 